it's Friday. I didn't think it'd ever get here. No, it, it took its time this week. <laughs> it's been a rough week. Oh yeah, I got plenty of gloves. We do have plenty of gloves this week. Can't have too many gloves. I always lose one of them. I can't lose both <laughs> of them. I just lose one. Right? Or one of them gets a hole in it, and then both pair, or both of them bad. It's always the same hand too, for some reason. Yeah. Ain't like you mix and match them. Uh, what? It, you, you can either work in gloves or you can't. In the automotive world, that's uh, some people can work in them all the time. Some cannot. Well, how's life on the Matco truck this week? It's been good. Good. Yeah. Weather has been definitely been an issue this week, but we <laughs> we're getting it through it anyway. Man, we get all four seasons in a week, don't we? Man. I? It is nuts. Let's go from summer to winter to tornado season back to winter, I guess. I don't know. But Absolutely. We'll get there. I think it's supposed to be summer this weekend, so we'll see. Well, if it don't rain us out. <laughs> what you got new this week? We've been showing the swivel button clip tool. Yeah. Um, pretty neat little design. It's for like the EVAP uh, lines and stuff that you have mm -hmm. to squeeze and it uh decides to pivot and then also you just so you know on top of fuel lines something like that you know they made them with the cable that you could reach up in there yeah. um those are still really good but you don't really want to fight with the cables when you're undoing it from like the the breather box or something like that mm -hmm. or on top of the valve cover or something so this is just quick easy and it, i mean you can move it any way you need it uh to get the job done uh it's just one of those tools that instead of using, a lot, I've seen a lot of people use like the hog ring uh, pliers to do it or something like that. The needle nose that's got the bent. Right. Uh, or I've, I've seen people uh, use just regular pliers. This is more designed for it, so you're less likely to mess the connector up. You can always mess it up if you're not careful. But Absolutely. Um, I know in several situations, if dirt and stuff gets in there, your hands just, your finger just gets sore trying. So mm -hmm. this just allows you to get a little bit more pressure on it to be able to break it loose. Always good to spray it out with brake clean, blow it out, that way it's good and clean, and then grab this tool and get it loose and get the job done. Look at the nice color on that thing too, it looks good. I do, I like the color. Looks good. Very nice. We got easy. the plier sets again, huh? We do have the plier sets. That one's going to be a little bit different. Most of the time, they are just the needle nose. This time, it has needle nose in it, but it's also got your variety. It's got a couple cutters, a couple of your hog nose pliers, um, and then some cutters, uh, some regular pliers. So that's cool. Just a couple different things. Cool, they did them in blue. It is. It's nice. So we're going to talk about color. We'll go ahead and go to the ratchet. We knew purple was here, mm -hmm. but as you can see, this is Black the new. Chrome. Yeah, well, this, they're calling it the nickel finish. Wow, looks good. Um, this is going to be available in all the different colors. We actually pre-ordered ours at our last meeting, which was last weekend. So I think they said August when they were coming out. Wow. But it's just a, a we've seen these at Expo, and they said that they may do them, they may not. Uh, and then some of, them, some of them said, yeah, we're, we're definitely probably going to do it because of the, the excitement that they had at Expo. But um, we act, she actually grabbed this one from the meeting. That way we could show it. Uh, so now you'll have your regular chrome, your flat black, or your black chrome, and then you'll have your uh, nickel finish here. That looks really good. Um, it looks good. It feels good, of course. Cause we've always talked about the way we like the handles and stuff. Well, I'm going to have one of them in blue. <laughs> So I'm, we ordered several of each color. Like I said, I think it said early August when they would have them. What I'm waiting to see, we talked about it this morning. Um, the, I guess the thing that I've seen the most with the black ratchets is people afraid to use them because they will eventually yeah, wear, the wear the black, the black off. off. Um, this is more of a finished ratchet here because it does have the nickel finish mm -hmm. to it. So I'm thinking that it's gonna be more like the chrome and protect that black. So. It's probably yeah, it going to be good. really like well. That. I'm hoping the camera really shows the the how awesome this looks and not just a black ratchet. But um, like it looks chrome in the in the camera, but it's a it's a darker yeah nickel colored finish. It looks well, good. I, guess I like it. Would, it. Uh, 
I guess I could grab a regular chrome and you could see the difference in them side by side. Yeah, that, I'm gonna need that same ratchet right there in a blue handle. So. Man, that looks really good. God, that's, that's, that's sharp right there. <laughs> so we, we actually have not showed this to anybody on the route, uh, on our route, because we wanted uh, to show it on the video first. And I'm a, this one's hers. She's done claimed it. Um, Cause she got, she decided she wanted one of every purple ratchet. So I'm afraid to show it to anybody on my route. Cause they, they're going to throw out some stupid price for yeah. it and I'm going to sell it and I'm going to be in the doghouse. So, um, I'm you can always not. replace it in August if That's, the price is right. Well, uh, <laughs> you can take a picture of it and cut it out and put it in your ratchet collection till the new one comes in. August is a long time to sleep outside, man. So I'm, <laughs> This, this is going to be hers, but I heard that. That, that is a, uh, you know. Well, make sure to put me one of that size back in blue because that's my favorite length of yeah, all of them. Um, that's, my, that's my most popular length. When the longer ones come out, they sold really good, but everybody's reverted back to the this, this length here. Yeah, that's a but perfect size overall. It gets in a lot of tight spots. Um, but it's it also leverage to yeah it's, break it's stuff got loose. enough leverage but it also don't have too much leverage to where you start breaking the anvil off and stuff yeah. like that so um you're not you're the anvil will eventually break just mm -hmm. over stress over time which of course you just change it out and go on but when you get that longer handle you tend to put a bigger socket on there yeah. it, it doesn't matter if it's a 19 this is a longer ratchet i got leverage and then you'll break it but uh, not every time because mm -hmm. i have people that come probably I don't know, once every three or four months and well, I broke it. Okay, no problem. Change it out and go back. But Cool. Uh, we asked them again at the meeting when they thought that the redesign, because they are coming up with another um, design for the lock here. It's going to be the same design, but it's, it's improved. So they're mm -hmm. not changing the way it locks, just changing the components to make it a little bit more reliable. So uh, still haven't got a definite answer on when that's coming out. I expect it to be this year, but I don't want to throw it out there this sure year. but sure you know we are seeing pretty good results out of the half inch where we did the the gear inside of it so it always well, that makes right for a there fun is time. awesome I'm, I'm digging the nickel finish it looks good <laughs> the nickel looks good yep. it does sure does well did my speaker thing come in we have not those things are everybody <laughs> decided to order them all at one time um that ain't no big deal i saw one of the distributors had ordered like 75 of them Wow. Another had ordered 50. So I don't know if Bump Box expected that to be that big of a turn. Sure. Um, yeah. Because when we, with anybody, when you go to a supplier and you say, hey, we think you to do this, they're mm. putting a lot of money on the line, usually to, if it does or it don't. So yeah. um, I'm proud they're taking off so much. My dad's waiting on one too. So Cool. Well. It's almost quitting time, and I'm ready for it to get here. The weekend will be welcome. <laughs> Golly, it's been a, it's just been a long, I don't know if it's the weather or it's just getting burned out or what, but Lord, it's been a long week this week. It happens. So it sure does. All right, guys, like always, thanks for hanging out with us. If you liked the video, hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools and discount codes in the description if you're not subscribed. Click the button. Y'all have a great weekend. See ya.